everybody, it's Deb from D&D Art Gallery. Today I have a 14 by 14 inch canvas that I'm just going to do a simple swipe on. I have not put down a base coat at all. And uh, let's just go over my paints. My first paint, and I did use up the rest of this one, it's Amsterdam Carmine. I actually cut the tube apart and I scrape out the paint just so I make sure and get it all. My next paint is also Amsterdam and it's the Amsterdam Turquoise Blue. And my next paint is Liquitex Basics Light Olive Green. It's a newer paint that I just got. My next paint is Liquitex Basics Camium Orange Hue. And my last paint is, and I use this one up too, it's Artist Select Camium Yellow Light Hue. So that is a way that you can make sure you're using up all your paints in your tubes is if you cut them apart and scrape them out. Because you'll be surprised how much paint you really do have left in a tube when you think it's empty. So my uh, swipe color today is just going to be Artist Love Flow Acrylic White. And I did add a little dollop of the Vallejo Pearl Medium to that paint just to give it a little bit of shine. And let's go over consistency. I think I have it a little bit on the thinner side. Just a little trace and then it disappears. And silicone, I am going to add just one drop of the Spot On Treadmill silicone in my white, in my swipe color. One drop, because I don't want to get too much in there. And I'll stir that in. And I'm going to swipe with uh, paper towels today. I think I will... Um, uh, moisten the paper towels and then swipe with them. So let's just get started with laying down the paint. I think I'll just start with blue. Just trying to find halfway point here. And I really do like this uh, this olive green color, very pretty. I'm trying to get springy here and paint with some happy colors. Now I'll go with the orange. And yellow. I think I'll tip too and try and fill in some of these little gaps I have here. And my last color is red, but I do see something here that doesn't belong. Let me get that out right away. I do like this carmine color. Okay, I think I'll just repeat my colors. Oh, pouring medium. Oh, I did go over pouring medium. Two parts Floetrol, one part paint, 
square to GAC 800. And about a tablespoon of the Liquitex uh, gloss medium and varnish, if I did not mention it. I know I mentioned the silicone. That is the pouring medium. That is my go-to pouring medium lately. This really does look very bright. And I have my red here. And I think I'll end with the blue. Okay, and I do see something in this yellow again that doesn't belong. Now I'm going to do a little bit of tipping here, see if I can cover a little bit more of the canvas. Add just a little more orange here. And I'll fill this little part in with the green. Okay. And I think I will give a little torch here before I get started. And I am, there we go. Okay, hopefully you can see that really well. And my torch color, or my swipe color here is my white, white. And I'm going to just add it now. I'm gonna start with a thin layer of the white. And just go from there. And now I'm going to just wet my towel a little bit. And carefully lay it in the white and swipe. And I'm just going to tap on the edge here to cover the edge. Okay, going to do that again. Careful. 
carefully lay it in the white and just drag it down. I'm not even putting any pressure on it at all here, just dragging it down. And I'm going to tap my edge again. And I do have a little one cut here for the end. And try and put that in there carefully. And drag it down. Okay, tap down here. actually tap on the sides too. Okay, I'm going to turn it over now. I'm just going to add a little bit more of the white, not much. Hopefully I'll just get a thin, very thin line coming out here. Okay. See how I'm just letting that paper towel just kind of glide over the end? That way a lot of that paint does come down. Give it another swipe here. Cover an edge over here. Okay, and one more at the end. Okay, I'm loving it. I just love all these colors, so bright, so pretty, so happy. And I'm going to torch it. I'm glad I only put the one drop of the silicone in. Just some very cute cells here. Okay, I'm gonna clean off the bottom a little bit. And 
and I'll bring you down for a close-up. More cells may develop too as it sits here. We'll just have to see. Again, this is the 14 by 14 inch canvas that I just did a simple swipe. Here is the upper left-hand corner and you're just gonna see all these really different cells. I, this is what I like, the red cell with the, then there's a circle of orange and another circle of darker orange. <laughs> They're so cute. And the blue with the red around them, the orange, they're, they're just so cute. That's the lower left-hand corner. And I will take you up the middle. Look at this cell, blue, and then the, and the green, and blue again, and red, and then the orange. It's very rare that you can get cells like that. These are these are nice up here too. Especially with the flow trial. Normally you just get like lacing with the flow trial, but these are really nice cells here. This is the upper right hand corner. I really like that light green. It does look springy. There's some more nice cells down here. This is the lower right hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Make sure and share it. Ring the bell, choose all, so you know the next time that I do post a new video. And until next time, take care everybody. Bye for now.